November 2023. So I've been here about a year, just over a year. I've been here nearly two months now. I started working at the Rambo Bush in July 2021. I've been here about two and a half years. I was uh, working at a special needs primary school um, and before that I worked in a um, behavioural unit within a mainstream secondary school. Yeah, um, and before that I was a hairdresser. Before going into healthcare I was a lab technician for 17 years. I was testing special alloys uh, for the motor industry, aerospace, military. I was working in the homeless sector for nearly two years uh, whilst I was a student at Oxford Brookes University. I was 18 when I started and when I left school I went to college and I did health and, I did my level three health and social care diploma. Um, how like amazing the team is in terms of being very supportive of one another. I knew that it was a school for children that were traumatised um, and just, it just appealed to me. And I think unconsciously I kind of planned my path to come and work here. My aim was to apply here and work here. Mm, and I heard of Marty Bush and I thought, that's where I want to be. <laughs> and yeah, I've loved it ever since. I felt ready. Uh, to face a challenge but in a more settled environment and when I came for the interview I, I felt I felt at home. When you first start here it, the children will reject you because their whole life they've been rejected by grown-ups and they just think you're another bad grown-up. Children um, get heightened very quickly um, they can become aggressive they can be verbally abusive to you. It's just good to be tested every time, it's every day you come in and again, however patient you are, there will be that child that can get under your skin. I would definitely say the RPIs, like a lot of the time when children do become di dysregulated um, and they do try and hit you and say they hate you and um, that is really challenging. I do, I do absolutely love working here and I remember when I first started bearing in mind having zero experience in this, I could not believe, I was sort of blown away with the support that my colleagues gave me and even people that I didn't know who worked here. My favourite part is settings. Um, it's the time that you have 15 minutes with the child, just low-key games or chat or card games, read a story. At that point, they don't always stay settled, but at that point, generally, they're very calm and they want you to be in the room with them and just have a nice one-to-one -one time. Um, so I've really enjoyed building those relationships up and, you know, I'm looking forward to doing, like, more activities with the children. Another thing is being able to have, like, good playtimes with them. When the child has been uh, looking for support and help and uh, you've been there sort of scaffolding and then there's days uh, your work shows in them uh, they can come asking for help or they can be very kind or they they manage their emotions and feelings and let you support them I think someone who wants to come here, maybe they should come and have a day in the school. It's going to be hard, it's going to be fun, it's going to be emotional, but it's all going to be worth. Just sort of get stuck in and just sort of jump into it and you'll either, you'll either love it or you'll hate it, but it's an amazing experience. You need to laugh a lot. Um, and think of the kids. That's, that's the reason we're here, is to look after them.